Welcome to Allium. Allium Medical's urological stents incorporate anti-reflux geometry, flexibility, large calibers and a 100% polymer coating, making Allium the stent company. Allium's proprietary polymer is embedding on the superelastic nitinol frame and is designed to prevent tissue ingrowth, calcification and stone formation. This ensures that Allium stents can remain implanted for as long as required. Allium's round posterior urethral stent, or RPS, is designed for the minimally invasive management of bladder neck stenosis. This is a narrowing of the posterior urethra, bladder neck, or both. The RPS is a large calibre stent that self-expands once in place. This effectively treats an occlusion such as bladder neck stenosis or recurrent stenosis. The body of the RPS is strong yet extremely flexible. Its shape is designed for optimal placement into the posterior urethra and bladder neck. The RPS is equipped with a transsphincteric wire. It also has an anchor designed to prevent backward migration. The shape promotes efficacy and patient comfort even over long indwelling periods. The RPS is delivered using the One Platform Delivery System, or OPS. This is a gun-style system that allows a streamlined and efficient endoscopic delivery. The delivery tool comes in a sterile, single-use pack, with an RPS pre-loaded on the device. It has a green trigger and a green safety lock button. The delivery tool is compatible with any 4mm optical element. An element is inserted into the top of the delivery tool until its lens reaches its edge. The locking clip is then placed over the element and is pushed downwards into the locked position to secure it in place. To deploy the RPS, the barrel of the delivery tool may be inserted through the urethra until it reaches the optimal position in the posterior region. To correct stenosis, the urethra may require dilation beforehand this may be achieved through the careful application of pressure using a balloon inserted through the urethra. Alternatively, the urethra may be dilated through cold knife incision or RF incision. To prepare for stent deployment, the urethra is lubricated. The delivery tool is then inserted under fluoroscopy. The tool is extended towards the posterior urethra, the optimal position for the RPS. This is the point at which the transphinteric wire reaches the sphincter. At this point, the trigger is unlocked by sliding the safety lock downwards. The trigger is squeezed several times to release the stent and deploy it into the correct location. The delivery tool is then retracted while ensuring the stent is in the optimal position under vision using gentle semicircular motions. Once in place, the RPS should perform exactly to the normal shape of the neck of the bladder, sphincter and posterior urethra. The RPS is safe to leave in place over long periods. However, if it needs to be removed, it is designed with an unravelling mechanism. This allows for safe, non-traumatic removal even after long indwelling periods. Allium stents are safe and effective and an ideal choice for a range of urological needs. Allium Medical, the stent company.